I'm Michaela, and you're watching DMV Cheer Zone. My name is Michaela, and I am a varsity coach at the Fairfax High School. So Kylan and I are both first year coaches, and we just took over the program a few months ago. It's been a lot of fun to just join the Fairfax community and to get back into cheer. Both Kylan and I cheered um, middle school, high school, competitive all-star, and then again in college. So when we had the opportunity to get back to cheerleading, we jumped at it. Great, so to get ready for our season, the big thing we did was our, have a choreography practice, and that was a full day practice where we got them to learn to routine and the cheers to make sure we were ready for comp. We've also been holding a lot of practices throughout the week to make sure they know their sidelines so they're also ready for our football games. And then a few team building events just to make sure everybody knows each other and is having a good time this season. So um, the big difference between sideline and competition team is that our competition team is going to need to do all the skills in cheerleading versus our sideline team will focus more on motions. The competition team is expected to do tumbling, stunts, cheer, jumps, and basically everything you encompass in a cheerleader all packed into two minutes and 30 seconds, whereas our sideline team will only have to remember the cheers and do motions at the game and just make sure they're full of spirit and ready for the games. So we are looking forward to both our homecoming game and senior night. That is a time where we get to really um, thank our seniors for their service. We do have five of them this year, so it's very exciting. And homecoming is also just a time to celebrate Fairfax High School and all the hard work that these seniors have put in to graduate this year. So we are trying to beat Woodson this year and just hit a really clean routine so that we can take home first at both district and regionals. I think one of the biggest things we're pushing towards our cheerleaders is to have confidence. Getting into cheerleading and you're new to it, it's hard to stand in front of a crowd of fans and be confident in what you're doing and really smile and project. So we want to make sure we give them confidence not just for cheer but also in life so they feel comfortable speaking up and speaking for what they believe in. Um, one thing about cheerleading that most people don't know is that we condition just as hard as the football team. We have them run miles at the beginning of every practice. We have them hold planks various times throughout the day. Anytime a cheerleader messes up, they'll do anywhere from 10 to 25 burpees. So it is a very um, athletic sport and most people don't realize that. I'm Michaela, and you're watching DMV Cheer Zone.